Hivers. Welcome to Honeybee Stamping Hive, where creative buzz is always in the air. I am Tashana Lundy, your independent Stamp It Up demonstrator, and today we are doing part three of my swaps from on stage here in Orlando, November 2018. This is the portion for the 3D projects, and there's a lot. <laughs> so we're just going to dive right in and get started. This first one is a very cute bag from Eileen Engel. It's so cute. There's a little tea light in here. And she backed the um, back of the, in the inside of the bag with glimmer paper. So when you light the tea light, it'll sparkle through the holes. Isn't that pretty? It's a battery operated tea light. So no fire caused. <laughs> Can't cause a fire. This cute little, oh my goodness. I don't know what this is. This video might be a little longer because we're going to have to open everything. Look at the little flag. She made a flag. Can you pull it? Oh, it's a slider. Look at that. Merci, bonjour. Oh, that's so cute. Who made this? Sophie, this is so cute from France. Thank you. That was a good surprise. It says surprise and it was because I, <laughs> I thought something was just going to pop up from the top. That's so cute. And it comes with a little a flag. That is awesome. Thank you. Some surprises. Don Hefferman. Oh, it's a calendar and it stands up. I'm going to need to take this to work and put it on my desk. Thanks, Don. This one has no name. It's a little ornament. That's cute. No name on it, though. And look at this little package of goodies. Is there no name? Oh no, and she doesn't have a business card in there or anything. It's so cute, look at all this stuff. A, a little package of soup and tea. It's like a get well, sending you the healing vibes. It's a get well package. You can't tell who is, oh my goodness, it smells so good. Mmm, that smells good. <laughs> it smells delicious. That tea bag. I wonder what kind it is. It smells good. There's no name though. That's a lot of work and you didn't put your name in. Look at this gorgeous little thing. Oh my. This is cute. Look at that. It's a little candy cracker for you. And there's something in there. Oh. It looks like a Snickers. <laughs> Bite-sized candy wrapper box. Yvonne Salinger. Salinger. From South Carolina. Cute. And she gave picture tutorial. How awesome is that? Wow. Thank you. Thank you so much. I've never gotten a picture tutorial on a swap before. That's awesome. That takes time. Here's one from, oh man, Charity Wright, Stamping with Love. Isn't that cute? Oh, what is that? Are those mints? You have to be able to see what's in there. There's something in there. Sending good tidings of comfort and joy. You can smell it. It's some type of Altoids. Look at that. A cute little holder. This is cute. Thank you. I love 3D items. I love them. Oh, no. Some people's... This... Oh, man. There's no name on this either. This is so cute. I remember speaking with the um lady that made these, but 
Her name is not on here. It's just a cute little candy cane holder. Oh, this one came apart. There's no name on it either. It's just a cute little tag. Look at the little bell she put on there. Isn't it cute? This one is from Shelly Castles. I think it's a gift card holder. That's what it looks like to me. But let's open it up and make sure. Yeah. Oh, but look how it opens. That's cute. That's different. I like that. I'm sorry, you guys. It's going to take a while, so you might want to go pause the video, grab you some coffee or a cup of tea, because this is Sharon South. Another calendar. Isn't that cute? All these cute little ideas. This one, yep, it stands. So I can sit that, sit that on my desk here at the house. Oh. Thanks for swapping, she says. Gilly Hunt. This is designer series paper that she rolled up and made. She made earrings. She gave um, she had earrings. She gave me a couple of options. But isn't this cute? It's just designer paper that she rolled up and like, I guess put glue on it. I'm not sure. acrylic wood varnish okay isn't it's pretty and here's another one similar this one is created by Kimberly Kimberly Newman yeah some interesting things I've never done those kind of things before and this one we're gonna have to take it out because the name is covered up oh because it's a <laughs> it's folded over because it goes over your water bottle because it holds the little packet. This is from Martha Henry. Teen Stamp It. Stamp It. Is that what Tammy White? Oh, this is cute. I'm not sure that sounds familiar though. Let me see. We have, have a wonderful adventure. Oh, it's a pullout made by Heidi Sue Olson. That's cute. I never seen the little pullout like this that had a card thing to it. That's cute. Nice. Kind people are my kind of people. Oh man. What do we have here? Oh goodness, it's a whole survival kit. <laughs> Look at that. Just everything. Oh, good. She has her card in here. Barbara Allen. Thank you. You guys put so much work into these swaps. I'm happy your name is on it. Oh, it's a survival kit. <laughs> Band-aids and nail files and gum, paper, and a pen. Something you can just drop in your purse and keep it handy if you need it. This is from Sylvie Dorsey. That name sounds familiar. I wonder if she has a YouTube channel. Because I've heard that name before. Oh, look. It holds a little candy bar. I can't get it out. <laughs> I just wanted to see what kind it was. Isn't that cute little Ruloff? Be jolly. That's cute. These little simple things. Oh, look at this cute little box. Oh, man. I love a little box. Let's take this off and see if there's a name inside. No name. Oh, but it holds a tea light. Hmm. I would like to know who gave this to me. I was just swapping. I was just excited to be there at my first on stage. Here's another little box. How do you get inside of this one? Oh no, I don't want to tear it open. Oh, you have to get inside. You have to tear it open. No. Okay, I'm not I'm not gonna do that. I don't want to tear it up. It's too cute. 
Oh my goodness, look at that tiny little strip of designer series paper on there. Isn't it cute? And I don't even know who made it. Oh my, look at this one. Lainey Radcliffe. What's in there? That's cute. Oh, it's a Tic Tac holder and it looks like a little book. That's so cute. Thank you. Great idea. See, I'm going to have to oh, get into this later so I can see how to make it. I like that. This one is from Kathy Cow at Silly Cow. Okay, look at that little post-it note holder with a pencil and a binder clip and a calendar oh man now i have too many options to go on my desk this one has multi-uses it has the post-it note and everything i can clip a little picture here if i want that's cute then we have a little box here with no name no paper rattling inside it's cute but she didn't label her name on it I like it. Good idea on how to decorate those boxes. Look at this little, one of the self-closing boxes. Uh-oh, did it come off of there? Let's see. Oh, there's candy inside, little Hershey Kisses, but there's no name. It's so cute. Oh, wow, this is a big one. Look at that. I just love this little set. Is there a name on it? No? Oh my goodness, you guys do such good work and then you don't give yourself credit. Is there a paper in here with a name? No, it's not. Oh. That's so pretty. I just destroyed it. <laughs> Trying to see what's inside. Okay, I don't want to... I'll have to do it back later because I'll destroy it even more I'm trying to do it on camera. And look at this. There's goodies inside, little sweeties in there. But I can't see paper, so I don't know who it's from. And I don't want to take it apart right now to see if there's something down at the bottom. But there's it's full of sweeties, so cute. Handcrafted just for you. And we have, I don't know, there's no name. That's a nail file holder. Cute. Nice and simple. But it's cute. Great idea. Everything doesn't have to be big and fancy. Something nice and small. Cute. Look at this. <laughs> you can, she left it blank. Oh, oh, her card. Thank you. I was going to say no name. Crystal Connolly. This is cute, Crystal. Oh, look, the back of the reindeer is back there. The little, oh, this is the little pocket die. That's cute. I wonder, what's that, embossed? Yep, it is. That's cute. I'm trying to put everything back in the package so nothing won't fall apart. Here's another bottle, um, water bottle tag from Renee Mant Matney. Cute. That's cute. Then she put a picture to show you what you're supposed to do with it, just in case you don't know, because everybody doesn't. A tag wishing you peace, love, and all peace and love all year long. I told you guys I can't read when it comes to reading on camera for some reason. Teresa Chandler. Pretty Teresa. Oh, and she embossed it. I didn't even notice. Look at all the glimmer. I love 3D. Have I said that already? Look at this. A cute little bag. Inside of a bag. <laughs> Who is this from? Christy Tob Tobin. Christy Tobin. Look at that. Cute. Oh, it's tied together. I'm not going to untie that. There's something in there, though. Isn't it cute? Let's just put this all back in there. Look at this. A little ink pen and a bookmark. 
She put the designer paper inside the pan barrel. Christine Kerpel. Kerpel from Pennsylvania. Isn't that cute? Do something creative every day, it says. That's cute. Okay. Um, this is from Wine Tag, created by Sarah Muth from Virginia Beach. So you put it on a bottle of wine. Sorry, it got a little crumpled. Look at this cute little thing, a bag of sunflower seeds. Hello, friend. This is from 2B Creations with Stamp It Up. Mm. Oh, created by Sarah Muth from Virginia Beach. That's cute. This one, it's a little, looks like a, um, oh, you know what? I bet you this, this was in another thing. This was on here and I was wondering where it came from. Yep. That goes together. The Tropical Chic Suite. Amanda Farlinger. Cute. Coffee Crisp. What is, where is she from? Because I've never heard of that. Hmm. Those are, this is a cute little pouch. Looks like it was made with an envelope punch board. Let's see. It's a cute little bag. I like this sweet. I made my, um, my 3D swap. One of my 3D swaps was I used this suite of paper as well in the stamp set. So there's little goodies in here, but no name. Oh. Is there a paper down there? Nope, that's just the designer paper. Oh, thank you. I don't know who you are. It's cute though, a little baggy. Look at this, some earrings. She made the little earring holder to hold the earrings. Carrie Kisilowski. Hmm. Guys, I can murder a name. <laughs> oh man, what is this? How do we get in here? I want in. Teresa Summer. Summer, I'm sorry. Teresa Summer from New York. Just for you. Hmm. You guys, I don't want to tear st Oh, oh, look. Oh, wow. Okay. Okay. This looks familiar. Have I made this before? I should know how to get in here, right? It's right from the back, is it? Oh, look at that. That's so cute. Oh, my. That's so cute. This is nice. I am going to be casing so much of this stuff. <laughs> So if you see your project on my blog, you know why, because I love 3D. And this is so cute. I love the way that opens and for the card and then flip it the other way and get to the box part. And here we have, oh no, I don't know who it's from and I think whatever was inside fell out. It's cute. That's pretty. But I don't know who it's from. Karen Rivenberg. It's a tablet. Isn't that cute? A note for you. That's cute. Hmm. I found a piece of candy. Yep. I think this was in there. That's cute. <laughs> I still don't know who it's from, though. <laughs> Oh my goodness, when I seen this, look at this, guys. Look at this. Look at this pen. Look at that flower on there. Isn't that pretty? And then she put it like, she had it in a little box she was carrying around her neck like a flower box. It was so cute. I was so happy she wanted to swap with me. 
because I really wanted one of these. This is so cute. Look at this little tag she made. Hopefully her name is in here. Yay. Angela Trahan, Trahan from Louisiana. Isn't that cute? I love that. And then this, what is this? Jingle all the way. Oh, it's a gift card holder. Wow. You can put a card on one side and a gift card on the other. Oh, there's no name. I thought her, I was for sure her name was going to be on the back of the inside card. That's cute, though. Nice, nice. Some of these things I've never seen before. I've never seen a fold like that. Look at this cute little thing. It just holds a little, the Smarties. Isn't that cute? Karen Banks. Thank you, Karen. That's so cute. And this one, a little luggage tag. Do something creative every day, but her name is not on it. That's cute. And this one is from Bet Brooks. It's a pillow box. Let's see. Oh no! From Canada, she sealed it with her name tag. Oh. I'm going to have to tear it in order to get inside. Oh, no. The little bow fell off. Am I that rough? Oh, no, I'm not. It just probably fell. Let's see what's in here from Canada. Oh, some coffee crisps. See? I knew that wasn't. I have never seen these before, coffee crisps. From Nestle. Okay. I've never seen those. Is that something that we can get here in the U.S.? Because I've never seen them. They look yummy. Look at this. I love peppermint. Uh, there's no name. Oh, no, you guys. Isn't this cute? I love a peppermint. This is cute. May this season be the sweetest ever. That's cute. I like tiny, tiny 3Ds. Oh, a sewing kit. Leslie Carmen. It's a little sewing kit. Mm, that's so cute. Another thing you can just pop in your purse. And this next one is from Nancy Perez. I think I swapped a card with her too. Look at this. It's a notepad. Isn't that pretty? I love this stamp set. I'm going to have to find it in the catalog because I overlooked it. How did I do that for this long? A matchbook. Oh, look. Tammy Wooly. Don't let me butcher your name. <laughs> That's cute. This is from Pat Warner. Goodness, what's in here is heavy. Oh, hot cocoa. Man, it's that's a full pack of hot cocoa because it's heavy. They didn't skimp out on that one. They made sure to fill that bag up. And this one on stage November Mary Jones from Elk Grove, California. Look at this. To my main squeeze, pucker up. <laughs> Little lemon drops. Isn't that cute? And you guys, let me show you. Before I show you my last swap, I'm going to show you mine. This is what I made for one of my 3D items. I got this idea from a blog. I think it's called um, Rejoice and Create. Create and Rejoice. One of those. Flip flop one of them rejoice and create or create or rejoice i'm not sure how the name is but i was on her um looking on youtube and i seen her video and i went to her blog and she um excuse me she had a video and the instructions on how to make it it is so cute and simple i made like 40 of these things 
And I somehow this got um left behind in my bag with all of these 3Ds. So I think I was passing them out and it might have fell back into my receive bag. So I didn't get a bit out. So that was one of my swaps that I was handing out. So yeah, that was cute. Okay, but something very fantastic happened to me. You know, in the Stamp It Up world, we have our celebrities. And when I first started stamping, I had just moved to a new city. I didn't know anyone. My upline lived in a different city. So I took to um, to the internet to learn. And I found Don Griffith at donstampingthoughts.net. She was a lifesaver in more than one way that she didn't know. But um, I got to meet her. She is the sweetest. And I kept wanting to swap with her, but she was all out of swaps. And then she had some gifts that she had um, for her teammates when they were going out to dinner. She had little chocolates for them. And she was like, oh, I can give you one of these, but I just have enough. And she said, I wanted everybody to have a piece of chocolate. Well, I still had my swaps. So I gave her one of mine and she gave me one of hers. And I was so excited. It's just the cutest little Hershey, um, Hershey nugget. Look at that. She made it with the envelope punch board. Isn't that cute? So simple. But I was very excited to meet her. And she even took a picture with me. She's my bestie now. <laughs> she doesn't know it, but we're besties for life. That's it. It's done. Hey, best friend. <laughs> well, that is all of my swaps that I received from on stage. All of my goodness, my happiness. This is the stuff that makes me happy. <laughs> If you want to join in on the fun, you can always join my team at Honeybee Stamping Hive. I would love to have you. Think about it. Give me a buzz. I, we can talk. You won't regret it. Okay, that's it for today. Don't forget to leave a comment, like, share, and subscribe. And as always, I want to thank you for buzzing by the hive today. Until next time, buzz you later.